We really feel like we treat patients in a multidisciplinary fashion, which is kind of a new term in, in oncology, meaning we, we get radiation oncology, medical oncology, the surgeon. We all get involved and discuss the case amongst ourselves and try to figure out what the best plan of action is for, for each patient. We all involved in those cases. In those meetings, the oncologist will be there, the pathologist will be there, the radiologist will be there, and uh, even the primary care and the surgeon will discuss each case and how can we treat the patient well, and everybody can you know, know what's going on with the patient as a team. So we try to do our best to help everybody in, his, in this diagnosis. Uh, we meet on a regular basis and evaluate patients' uh, care. Uh, what, uh, sometimes it's, it's after a tumor has been taken out when we talk about what needs to be done from there. Sometimes it's before when we talk about whether tumors need to be taken out, what types of chemotherapy, radiation therapy. Some studies have suggested that multidisciplinary care is better instead of one physician just making all the decisions and not necessarily having expertise in all of the different aspects of the patient's care. We then get together all the providers and discuss the patients and it certainly results in better outcomes, better patient care. So it's many doctors from different specialties, radiation therapy, chemotherapy, general surgery, neurosurgery, any specialty that has any type of interest in, in the management of the patient and we go through and, and get a comprehensive plan. It's really state-of-the-art care. The St. Francis Cancer Treatment Center in Grand Island at Hastings, well beyond healthcare.